how the student success panel now. So uh, hopefully you guys, you guys just want to hear from, from others that were sitting, sitting there where you are and now have, um, have joined the program and have had success. So I want to invite up to, um, I'm going to stop sharing and we're going to invite up to the screen. We have our award music where we can cut the <laughs> Um, all right, turn off the award music and have, I'm going to invite up, um, I'm going to invite up Glacia Cooper, Glacia, let's uh, spotlight her, and um, I'm going to invite up as well Donna, um, Donna Byron, if we can spotlight her, spotlight, and then Cynthia, Cynthia Tedderton-Williams. So these are um, three goddesses. So all of them were at the last event. Uh, Cynthia was sitting in the front row as a hadn't joined. She joined. She joined the program in, in March, uh, and so we'll we'll well since you're, I'll just start with you since I've already started on your your story. But you okay. were. We're sitting, you were, you were in the front row most of the time, super excited. You were like the first person to run to the back of the room to sign up for the program. <laughs> you joined in the mastermind and, um, you know, in this past month and a half, what have you done? Well, Monique, thank you, first of all, for inviting me to be a part of this um, forum. Um, what have I done? Wow. And you're at the very core of the things that I have accomplished. So first, I, I want to say thank you for that, too. Um, yeah. I have purchased um, a studio apartment um, I'm in Ohio. And um, some of the wonders of our area in, the, um, in this area is to get a sweet spot. When you talked about location, a little sweet spot um, on Lake Erie. So I've um, purchased a studio apartment in a building that just faces right at Lake Erie. And you can see all the wonderful downtown area and all the all of the activities in the boating. So it's just that that place that you want to be during most of the year, really, you know. So I was able to do that with um, some wonderful ideas and resources and things that you have, some of the things that you have gone over and that, of course, you went over in your, um, the three-day summit. Um, I'm under contract now for a town home. Well, that's in Ohio. And I'm under um, contract now for um, a town home in right outside of Atlanta, Georgia. So those are the two things at this moment. And um, <laughs> in a month and a half, y'all. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Ooh, well bragged. So good, so good. So why did you join the Wealthy Cost Program? Wow, I was looking for, I yes, I was looking for something, looked at several programs that were more women-centered. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, women oriented, you know, supporting us. And um, I saw quite a few out there and some that, you know, I knew were supposed to be very successful. But for this particular program, um, this for me, it was a better fit because anyone who knows me, um, the 2022 and I guess part of 2021, it was all about my time, my season of authenticity. So anything I did, I touched, you know, whether it was work, play, whatever, had to be truly authentically coming, something that I, I meant something to me. And that's what I saw in this program. Not only did it have all of the tools and a wealth, I mean, a plethora of resources that I didn't even know was out there. I knew I needed more. You know, you just kind of don't know what you don't know. And what I did know is I didn't know everything. And there was so much more that I needed to support me and what I wanted my goals to be. I saw it. I saw everyone. It was like checking off a box and then another and then another. And I just felt that I was in the right place. I, I truly did. And it was I knew it was time to invest in me. And it was I knew every penny would be worth the investment in me through the Wealthy Goddess program. I just, I just not look back and I'm just so thankful. Oh, so glad yeah. you're here. 
So to what do you attribute your success? Because that's that's pretty good. Two deals in like less than two months. <laughs> um, I'm a very good listener. Very good listener. And through your program, you have a lot to say. A lot of you, you place a lot of other resources, very skilled, very talented um, individuals before us that have a lot to say and a lot to offer. And I remember you saying this was um, when I was first introduced to the, the program. I don't know if it was Facebook, whatever, but I remember you saying that I'm not saying it's going to be easy. It is going to be hard work, but we're here. We have the resources. If you step up and put in, it's, it's, it was almost like, and I don't even know if you said that, but it's like, I won't let you fail. I heard that. I listened mm -hmm. to all of that. And I pretty much did what you said to do. And so I've tried to be present. I've tried to listen. Um, I've tried to ask all of the right questions. And it's not even that I knew the questions to ask in everything, but you offered it and I followed it. And then those other resources, I just, I'm trying to take advantage of every morsel that you put out there. And it's, it's working for me. It is working very well for me. And that's the other thing that I'm so excited about is because I see it working for so many other women. And it's like, well, if it can work for them, then why not me? And yeah. so, yeah. Amazing. Yes. Yeah. Um, so what, what have you liked? I mean, you, you just started, but what have you liked best about the Wealthy Goddess program so far? The creativity, um, the accessibility of, um, I don't, accessibility of you and your team, because you keep saying, you know, it's important to have a team. You have an amazing team and um, the resources that you, you avail to us, um, I, I, I mean, I, I just can't see us, anyone taking advantage of this, not feeling, wow, why didn't I do this sooner? And that's what I like the best about it is because I finally feel like this is the place I'm supposed to be. And it's not a one size fits all. It's just so much creativity. And it's like, I can find my place. And, and, and then somebody else can find hers. Oh, and this is the thing I wanted to make sure I didn't forget to say. Every single time I am tuned in to anything you offer, Coach's Corner, Q&A, um, accountability pods, the, just whatever, our training, I learn something. And I am a lifelong learner. That's what I was brought up to be. And I'm telling you, it is never, there are many things that I already know just because, you know, experience. But there's always something, and it's something very valuable, like, wow, like one of those mind-blowing things that's going to save me a lot of money, <laughs> a <laughs> lot of thanks, you know, it's, it's just so worth it, hmm. so worth it to, to spend your time just to be present, you know, so thank you. I, I just, I'm, I'm excited. I just don't know how to, I don't know how to put it any other way, but thank you. I finally feel like I found what was most valuable to me and that will help me towards the goals that I have at this, this season in life, this chapter, and to help me build this legacy that I want, you know, um, a strong legacy for my family, financial legacy. Beautiful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Uh, that's amazing. So Donna, I want to hear from you. So why did you join the Wealthy Goss program? Well, I, I'm going to say first, you know, to get some context, I am not a joiner upper of things <laughs> monthly. You, you, you all think that I'm, you know, this yeah, being in this club is such a in, new part of my life. And it's so beautiful, like, like Cynthia was saying. And, uh, you know, I came to an event like this. I had done a little bit of real estate investing, but feeling like I was sort of grappling in the dark on my own. And, you know, in other forums, you meet you meet others who are doing something, get their card and bring it home. You know, it's just not, you can see the sort of expertise and the willingness to share that this community has. And this is a committed relationship, right? All of us here. It's not just you go watch a podcast. I mean, you do presentations for us. We, we're right there together. We can ask questions, right? It's just not like the other kind of learning opportunities in real estate and 
the other thing that, well, when I noticed when I, when I came to your first event, that it was like a weekend event then, but that you really talked so much more about, you know, what sort of, what sort of presence are you bringing to this activity? It's not supposed to be a drag. <laughs> And, it, you know, all of my other training has been more like, you know, well, you're just going to slog through your day and you are whatever professional, whatever. And it, it just, it, you're the core desire feelings that you mentioned a few minutes ago. That's just one example of the sorts of material you brought to my life that I didn't know about before. Mm-hmm. And now instead of my my three checklist things on my phone, instead of um got you know eat right exercise whatever boring 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 now it says feel alive like every day you got to do something that makes you want to jump for joy right oh, Why not? I love that <laughs> uh, alive feel alive feel connected and creative so when I structure my day like that you know I'm rolling toward a, you know a more beautiful life and then um you you know you really put a lot of good detailed information out there that gets a good uh to us in the stuff you do in the podcast and everything in the in the lessons that we get and the experts you bring like you've just seen on that panel um it's really good scaffolding like i had you know some knowledge of how to evaluate a location if you want to invest in another state but not enough detail to really go do it uh so you've really you know increased my education enough to just to be able to execute um and this whole team building and the, we get a lot of interaction with each other. You get to meet a lot of the other people. There are a lot of um, entrepreneurs and self-starter people, people who are property managers, are you know, c- colonel in the army <laughs> that have a get it done, like a, the buck stops here kind of attitude that I'm just not around much otherwise. So I think that, you know, that's all been really good for my just whole approach to feeling empowered, empowering the community of other women. We all succeed together, you know, that's a great place to be. And I could get that out of the um, the weekend that I came to a year and a half ago. And what have you accomplished since joining? I have accomplished, I'm gonna say, well, besides just kind of this whole lifestyle of feeling like I want to jump for joy every day. And uh, so let me just pause there because that's huge. <laughs> if you got nothing else but that, I would feel like that was supremely successful. Um, <laughs> like just being able to jump for joy every day. That's amazing. Yeah. Like, right. that. yeah, yeah. Good. <laughs> um, I mean, and then like tactically I've gotten into four I was actually trying to count before you started. We started four syndications that two were people that you introduced us to in the network. And one was a whole asset class I never even knew existed before. Uh, Though, let me see, I bought, sold a property and turned that money into, I bought two short-term rentals last year. And I also uh, networked in the community with people, you know, it's more of a trusting kind of relationship in this community, but you still got to do your due diligence Mm -hmm. to know, to, I did a private loan to a lady who's a, it's not a flip, it's a buy and hold. So she does the, you buy it, you fix it up a little bit, you put a tenant in it, you, you buy it with a private loan first, and then later on you can refinance. So she just refinanced to pay me back. So that was a whole successful exit of a whole your money You're came up. back with friends. <laughs> a little bit of friends. And it's so beautiful. I mean, she's got kids. She's running this business. You know, it's a terrific win-win situation. I put my money to work a little delegated. So learning more uh, evaluation strategies and feeling like if I need to understand what to do, I've got somebody in this network I can ask. Everybody reaches out and helps each other. Edwin or... Cheryl or you know you you all if you need some help you just kind of put up the bat signal and somebody is there that's done it that can help you Mm. that doesn't mind that you have a question and it's never a dumb question (laughs) and I I just need a lot of cheering like in the in the in the pods that we do we do like daily check-ins or however frequently um I mean, I just need a lot of times for, I need a cheer. Can you just give me a cheer? Or I just need a little bit of emotional support here. And it's hard to be kind on your kind to yourself. There's a, to plenty of opportunities to make mistakes, but there's always a way to 
fix it and figure it out, right? So having the right team that helps you think through that instead of panicking and running away or saying you're never gonna do it again, right? I think that's a big component of success. Amazing. So, so let me see. So you you got you did four syndications, a private money loan, and two short-term rentals since since joining, and you sold yeah. the property. And I sold the property. Oh, so that was not that's kind of the real estate box, but also I got finally some legal understanding of how to do the legal structuring because you pointed us to those kind of resources too, which honestly was a blocker before because I didn't. I didn't know how to be protected. And, you know, you feel like you're taking a step and maybe it'll be great. Maybe I'm just exposing myself in some weird way, right? I don't, you don't know. So I had the right uh, connections to resources there. Uh, and I also tried two other, I got a real good deep dive into two other things that I turned out not to like. So it's good to know. <laughs> so that, you know, the time you invest is, is all kinds of different ways you can go about it. You don't have to yeah. do the one that you don't like. I love it. Well, it's good to know what not blow. to do too. Yeah. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Ah, so good. Um, all right, Glacia, how about you? What did, why did you join the Wealthy Guys program? Um, I joined like most people because I wanted, um, I wanted financial freedom, but I remember when I was very young, you know, like 21 years old, I wanted to retire early. No one told me this. I just knew it from a young age that it was important to retire early. But as time went by, I also realized in order to retire early, I have to have financial freedom. So because of a series of events, I stumbled upon real estate. So I decided that real estate was gonna be my vehicle to find financial freedom and ultimately retire early. So um, I decided to, you know, start by using YouTube, the internet and researching. And that's when I stumbled upon this program called Bigger Pockets and on Bigger Pockets, that's where I found Monique because Monique was giving a talk one day at Bigger Pockets and I was inspired by what she was saying and then after I finished watching that, then I decided to go look up Monique's website. And on the website, I loved the things that she said, especially about this is a sisterhood. And there was also another uh, area that she said, won't you like to be around other people that will, will not make you fail? That resonated with me also. So I, said, yes, I'm going to use real estate because this could, you know, increase my, my wealth exponentially and take me to where I can be easily, easier. So uh, I, you know, started to read a lot of books to get the knowledge and stuff. But shortly after I read about Monique's site, I decided that I'm going to join. So I joined in October 2020. And uh, my journey began there just because I know that it is important to have financial freedom. Yes. Yeah, beautiful. And, and what have you accomplished since? Well, since I started, I did two syndications. I also um, joined the EQRP and I also partnered with another goddess and bought an investment property. And right now I'm, I'm also in, in contract on a duplex that I'm buying in Houston. <laughs> nice, so amazing. Um, that is so great. And um, so to what do you attribute your success? Definitely this program, you, Monique, and also the other goddesses that have, have, the, have had the opportunity to meet. And I really enjoyed the Q&As. I enjoy the pods. Uh, and um, I, I enjoy, you know, that's the basic support level that we get from each other. And also, I, 
attribute it to the fact that I show up because you have to show up. There are days when all uh, these parts meet so early, I really don't want to get out of bed. <laughs> but, <laughs> because I'm not an early riser, but I tell myself, you, you got to do this. You got to do this. So I, I show up. I committed to it. I paid and I committed to it. And I, through the encouragement from other goddesses and Monique, I realized I can do this. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. And, and what do you, what have you liked best about the Wealthy Goddess program? Well, what I like best is the fact that I have an amazing amount of information, the wealth of knowledge that I've gained and the relationship that I've developed along the way with a lot of other goddesses. And, and my favorite is the pod group, the pod groups. Yes. Yeah, beautiful. Oh, it makes me so happy to, to see your success, but definitely, I mean, what is, what I know about each of you is you show up, you know, like I say, the, there's, I think, I think hopefully I give you everything you need to be successful um, in the program, but it doesn't work unless you, you work it right. And each of you yeah. show up for it. You, you, you show up for the things. If you're not able to be there, you watch the recordings, you, you know, you're, you're showing up for this. Um, it, it, so that's, and you, and you have the success to show for it and it's amazing. And it's so inspiring. 